Hey, I'm actually here. And sorry, I hit the button on my microphone instead of unmuting it from the software. Give me one moment, please. Good morning. Oh, oh no, that should start up since that's... Sweet! Okay, pausing the music. And also, turning on dog cam. Hello. No, you can't have my lip balm. No. He's already waiting. He knows it's here. I have peanut butter for him. One moment, please. Excuse me? Don't. Why is it being a butt already? The puppy. Hi, puppy. No, you can't have it yet. It's broken. Why? <laughs> Every time I think I have things settled, I don't. No, that's the wrong one. Game capture. That's the wrong one, too. This is true. Why does it keep losing that? Excuse me. No! <laughs> That's the wrong thing. That's the sound capture. Oh, come on. No, stop nudg nudging me. Nope. Stop it. Oh, screw it. Have some music. <laughs> That one. Aha! Oh, that's awkward. There we go. Okay, so today we're continuing The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. Ooh, last time we played we got marooned! I can say marooned and it's actually the right thing to say! On an island in the sun. Uh, we're not having fun yet, but... Give me a minute. He is insisting I give him his peanut butter. On-screen chat- Oh, whoa! Why is that weird? Hold on. No, that's not the right one. What? Um... Why is it weird again? There. Okay. Cool! Hello! Hi! Sorry! Peanut butter time! <gasps> Puppy! Puppy, what are you gonna do for me? You drooled on my armrest! Oh, I love you! Oh! Give me a second! Puppy! Goofy pooch. <laughs> he is such a good pupper. Okay. First things first. I need to move things slightly. What are you doing? <sighs> Jerk. He turned around so nobody could see him. <laughs> okay. Alright. Let me open my tea bottle. Sorry for the slight delay. Move that somewhere else. Hey, last time we played, like I said, we got marooned. Except we're wearing green. Um, we got our tunic. Our sister was kidnapped by a giant bird. We may have run into Ganon. And, in general, stuff is weird. So we have to fix it. As per the rules of being the hero. So let's get this party started. Why am I here? 
We've also met the King of Red Lions, and he can't go anywhere until we acquire a sail, so we've been meeting all sorts of strange people. And a gassy pig. Ooh, beer fest. Fancy. I'm not really a beer drinker. I've not developed the taste for it. Um, there's a bomb shop with the thing above it that is weird. There's a boncho kid. He's mean. Uh, we found Tingle and we have to help Tingle. I don't want to help Tingle. I don't like Tingle. <laughs> And there's weird pots stashed all over the place. I don't want them to see me. Escape! Well, I hope you have fun at Beer Fest. And a reminder to all that it is, in fact, Mother's Day this weekend. So if that's what you do, you do you. <laughs> this is the rich dude's house! what I do? All I can smell now is peanut butter. You are welcome. Where is Tingle? Tingle's up there. How do I get over there? Hmm. No! Um, that's, that's not where I need to be. Where do I need to be? Is this, this isn't it. Go in the house. Get away from the kids. I think they punch me. Parkour indeed. Oh, this is the schoolhouse. Well, that kind of rocks. Get away from the kids. <sighs> <sighs> Is he just back here, and I keep... Yep. What'd I do now? Why am I getting the side eye already? <laughs> I don't like Tingle. I see the same green clothes and the same green hat. By the look of you, I'd say. Sir, could you by chance be a fairy? Yes, Schoolhouse Rock. <laughs> Sorry. Goodness, did you feel my telepathy? That's why you saved me, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? Do not worry. Tingle knows without you telling him, sir. Yes, sir. Tingle is my name. I've been looking for you and your kind, for I, too, long to be one of the fairy folk. And yet, I was mistaken for some kind of troublemaker and put into this dreadful sort of place. How disrespectful. Please, Mr. Fairy, rescue poor Tingle from this place and take him to where you and your kind live in splendor. can't sword things in the houses, I am upset. Ooh, Rupee. Look, I opened the door. He's free. He's free to be arguably one of the weirder characters in this franchise. <laughs> Hooray! I thank you oh so very much. Here is Tingle's heartfelt gift of thanks. Tingle, tingle, kulu limpa. Become an item. Ugh, I don't want to know. You got a tingle bottle. Using Meverse, rip Meverse, you can insert a message you've written and send it out to see for someone unknown to receive. Set it to and use it with Y, X, or R. Be aware that you can't write letters if you're not connected to Meverse. Mr. Fairy, are you familiar with Meverse? 
with it, messages put in this bottle can be sent to fairies the world over. A communion of minds. Hearts beating as one. Just don't write anything unpleasant, okay? Not that I have to remind you, Mr. Fairy. Splendid. Tingle is returning now to his own special island. Will you come find- I don't want to. Is this like the island of misguided children or whatever the heck it was called from Peter Pan? <sighs> no, but probably. I'm gonna have to, I'm sure. Oh, I can't believe. <laughs> ah, I was forgetting something important. Oh, Mr. Fairy, you want to come to my island, don't you? Don't you? Don't you? I object. I seriously, wholeheartedly object to this character. <laughs> you got Tingle's chart. What kind of chart could it be? Head out to sea and then check your charts on the map screen to find out. Open it on the map screen. If you ever need any help with your charts, just leave it to Tingle. Don't forget it. And if you'd like to give your Tingle bottle that little extra oomph that all Tingle's grave, you should check out the back of this cell. Check it right out. Okay, you can now send letters in the Tingle bottles by using Meavers. You told me this already. Pick them up on the beach. You can adjust your messages settings anytime. Sure. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. We are now set to find Tangle Bottles. Let's break pots. Break all the pots. Wow, this camera angle. Am I right? <laughs> okay. <gasps> There's a blue ruby. It's a blue bee. That's the wrong. Buttons. There we go. The fact that I'm crawling under his bed still weirds me out. <gasps> there was a ruby in that bucket. How do I get the mushrooms? Can I get the mushrooms? I can't get the mushrooms. Okay, now I'm concerned that there are mushrooms growing on his bed. I have a sneaking suspicion. But there's probably crawl space behind this box. Oh, look at that! It is a weird bed, but it's a prison bed. Uh, duh. This is a maze. I wonder what gave me that idea. Ba -ba -ba. Ba -da. Ooh, that's a thing. Ah! No. 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 Oh, come on. Really? That's what we call a rat trick. <laughs> back up here. But first. Money! I will be rich by the time I leave this island. Is there more money? Yay, there's more money! Pooch is squeaking his toy behind me. It's kind of funny. Do 
really have to do this every time? Oh. That works. Indeed, we need them. Because eventually we'll probably need it for things. There we go. Now we don't have to like, look at Link's butt. I haven't. Mostly because sometimes he forgets he has ice, and then it melts, and then there's a peanut butter. There would be a peanut butter puddle, rather. <gasps> a bloopy. I didn't mean to turn there. That's okay. I did mean to turn here, however. Ah! Hello. <laughs> I was face to face with a killer bloopy. I'm actually tempted to try frozen peanut butter outside at some point. No, I went in a giant circle. I don't like that. Turn around. Turn around quickly. That's a trap. Or is it? Probably is. What is over here? We are back in Metal Gear Link Land again. Yep. That's what I wanted to happen. There's no more peanut butter pooch. That's it. This is true. All right, we helped Tingle, so now we can go talk to the dude in the parka. The fellow. The shopkeep. There's wind. Rescued him. That is news I deem rather great. You are one stand-up individual. Indeed you are. Now I apologize as I have but another favor. I'm actually considering starting up a little shop here on the island, but I'm having trouble funding my venture. Really? All the money. I have but one asset to my name. I wonder if you might buy it for me, perhaps. Is it the ship sale? I didn't tell people on Discord I was live. <laughs> Should probably do that. <laughs> Give me one second. So hi, how's everybody doing? Two seconds. One more. There we go. Ha ha! <laughs> I just tried to click on the game. I can't. <laughs> Alright. The people on this island have no interest in venturing out into these dangerous seas, so my chance of selling it to them is rather bleak. The bleakest I can describe. I'd really like to ask 200 rupees for it, but as a favor for recruit rescuing my friend, perhaps we may strike a deal. Hello, vampire! How does 80 rupees sound? I'll buy it. 
Yes, yes, yes. Thank you very much indeed. I have received precisely 80 rupees for it. I can use these funds to finance my new business. Oh dear me, what a happy day. As I promised, please take that. I can finally leave. Oh yeah, it is still morning there, barely. Good morning. <laughs> Boat sail. Yes, yes, yes. You have made a good purchase today, my young master. And you have saved my life and business as well. Treasure it dearly. It is the finest sail in the world. Treat it as such. <gasps> Link looks startled. Ah! <laughs> okay, I'm leaving now. Ooh, what's over here? Have I been here? Is this a thing? <gasps> There's a thing! And a pot. Bum bum. You look like a curious boy. Do you know there's an island a little to the east of here called Dragon Roost Island? Folks say that the island is the home of a tribe of people who dance in the skies like birds on the wind. They call themselves the Rito, and they say a sky spirit lives nearby. But to someone like me, a person who's never left this little island, it may as well be a fairy tale out of a children's book. Oh, if only I had my own boat. It's a blue bee. I got a blue bee. Bum, bum. I suppose I should try talking to the child. Let me save first, though. In case he punches me and I lose all my money. Saved! Bum, 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 bum. I know I'm probably going to have to come back here. Yo, bud, you looking for a picto box or something? Yeah, I thought so. There ain't nothing in this town that we killer bees don't know. Not the hedgehogs, a curse. <laughs> Boss, I heard about this from my dad. A while back, this thief, thief rather, stole a picto box, and he was held in the town jail for a long, long time. Yeah, real long. That thief managed to get a to get free after a while, but the box he stole never got found. <laughs> maybe it's still hidden somewhere in the jail cell. Don't you think? Maybe? Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't know what that was. <gasps> um, give me one second, please. Hello, I returned. Sorry. Dynamite with a laser beam. <laughs> oh, that would have been a better group. <laughs> I did. <laughs> I'm glad to help make your day. Yes, I know. Hello, Sun Spiral. How stupid would that be? Real stupid. That's how stupid. It's still in the jail cell. I will solve their problems, I suppose. MSX, thank you for gifting a sub to Tank Blade. Here is your sip for both of you. And also, enjoy your emotes. 
Or Dragon Blade, if you really want me to still call you that. You didn't? Oh! Oh, I brain farted! I misread, that was my bad. Sorry. Thank you for continuing the sub. <laughs> I apologize to both of you. <laughs> okay. Will do. I'll probably stick with Dragon Blade because that's what I'm more familiar with. It's still in here. It's still in here. It's it's in the stupid tunnel. I didn't explore the tunnel fully. <laughs> no! Doofus. Sorry, I'm getting a phone call. <laughs> okay, we're good. Push, 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 push. Alright, back through this mysterious tunnel. Seriously, I played Minish Cap, and this song is... Minish Cap was actually my second Zelda game. This song is going to be stuck in my head for months now. I just went in a circle. Oh, sorry, will do. Uh, is it better for you if Link is visible? Like, is staring at Link's butt actually better? Because I can do that. Let's see. You want the trap? There's a bloopy! Okay. I feel like I needed to follow the bloopies and I've just gone the wrong way. Horribly. Nope, don't go that way. Don't do it. Thank you. Okay, we're back here. I am, in fact, calling it a bloopy. Which isn't fair, because that's a critter in uh, Breath of the Wild, but still, I think I was calling them bloopies before bloopies. No, the red ones are rupees. The green ones are groupies. <laughs> no, those are youpies. <laughs> I did it! Oh, I am out of the tunnel. There is a treasure chest and a lot of skulls. This seems very questionable. Where is One-Eyed Willy? I feel like maybe I shouldn't open those yet. I'm gonna break the skulls first, because I don't trust them not to come to life when I open this chest. <laughs> Sorry. I'll stop. <gasps> it's a Yuppie. And also, I don't trust the rocks, so let's throw the rocks, too. And here we have Chester Copperpot. It's his new name. <laughs> Date unknown. At last, I have succeeded in stealing the Picto box I have desired for so long. Succeeded, yes, but sadly, due to a slight mistake on my part, I was also caught. 
I have been imprisoned, but I do not give in easily. I refuse to give this wondrous box to my captors. I have decided to hide it here in my in, in the depths of my cell, and then make my escape by tunneling out. Yes, that is my plan. Of course, if I ever successfully escape from this prison, I shall one day return to recover the Picto box. I will write the controls for it, in, just in case I should forget them. It is. Press ZR to switch to its delightful pictograph viewing mode. It saves up to 12 pictographs at a time. Oh, how it pains me to leave it. I just wish I could get out of here so I could start taking pictographs. Y, X, or R, as per usual. He's probably dead. I got a sub! <laughs> Dragonblade, thank you for gifting a tier 1 sub to Hans. Hans, enjoy your tier 1 gift sub. And your emotes. And one of these days, I will give you guys a third one. I just need to figure